GMB. Welcome to Houston, the bottom of the south. If you ain't from around here, you might not make it out. I done seen it all. Plenty bowed and foul. One day buying the mall, next day lost it all. Don't let the hype fool you. Keep the two close by. Two close These jackets will play cool and hit you with the four five. What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel, guys. I got another, 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 another upgrade for the boosted f-150 make sure you go follow me on instagram that boosted f-150 guys so i just got a package from david aka dave from um clusters by living it i think it's clusters by living it up man huge shout out to him by hooking me up with this new cluster so uh i have all his information and a link in description if you want to purchase one of these clusters so this is like a lariat king ranch limited type cluster but he did something that i'm probably the only person to have y'all know i have a supercharger in my f-150 so in the um eco boost turbo charger whatever you call them eco boost things uh they have a turbo gauge right corner i think well, since I have a supercharger, he programmed that to be my uh, boost gauge for my supercharger, which is crazy. And then I'm going to actually start up, well, not start up, show you a couple things real fast, how it looks before. All right, so this is how the, the dash looks before. I have 29, uh, 2,980 uh miles 0.9 so that 0.9 should be go to the 0.5 and he has it programmed to exactly that so all this is going to be digital all that's going to be digital up there i'm going to turn that one into the boost one i think but just look at it guys and see how it looks right now and when i finish installing this it's going to be really really crazy the difference of how it's going to look and everything and then I have my check engine light on because I'm converting to the folding mirrors I wait on the rest of the wire harnesses for that so here is the box right here I'm finna open it up um, guys it's gonna be crazy um, on this so I'm gonna actually kind of show y'all how to take the cluster out and everything as well so I just got the package today. He actually next day it to me as well too, guys. Oh, I dropped my keys. He actually next day it to me too, so that was awesome. Well package. And here goes his actual sticker right there, guys. bubble wrap in here let me put this box oh it's gonna stay right there now okay, he got it. really good so here is my new cluster guys and as you can see I got the sport on there and everything I don't know if y'all can see it, but y'all about to see it. And then, if you notice, on the grills we have now, they're blue. The little needles are blue. Mine is actually going to be red. So, yeah, it's going to be awesome. So, you only need a 7 millimeter uh, ratchet. So, you're going to pull this off right here. All right. So, you just hold that with your knees. 7 millimeter right here. And then on the opposite side, it's another seven millimeter as well so it's gonna be a quick installation if i don't drop nothing like i just did all right all right next thing you need to do is pull this out and you might want to shift this down and out your steering wheel pull this out and then you have this little piece right here, a little bracket, pull that out. All right, so you have another seven millimeter right here, right here, 
in here and in here, which is at the bottom left, guys. One, two, three, four. So it's only six, seven millimeters. Actually, let me get this one out real fast on the left hand side. See if I can get it. I might have to get another. I can't reach it, so I want to actually get my socket. to some reinforcements I think it's something just wrong with my seven millimeter all right there we go so you pull it out should be only one plug if I'm not mistaken one plug so this is the old one guys this is the new one. All right, so we're gonna take the new one. Plug it. Oh, the new one plugs in a different way. I think the old one. Yeah. So the old one plugs in like this. The new one plugs in like this. It's all in there. And this is actually a 2019 cluster as well. If y'all wanted to know. Alright, so everything seems to be dandy. Put the screws back. And that's honestly it guys. So I could actually show you before. So remember my mallets. 100% accurate. When you unplug the cluster, it goes to 29.5. So I had 29, uh, 29, 80.9. So it automatically goes to 25. So look at that, guys. There you go. The new cluster. Ooh, that mug is clean. Look at that, sport. You got red instead of blue. Uh, I wanna change my gauges. So this is my turbo. So gauge. Yes, uh, Turbo. Okay. And that's going to be actually my boost for my supercharge. Yeah. That's crazy. Yep, sir. Yep, so the new cluster, guys. Then you can do navigation compass as well. You can do a lot of stuff on here. Yep. 
video history. And then all this information is 100% accurate. So I didn't drive my truck for a week just because I can have all the information accurate. So everything is on point now. Yep. So let me finish. Let me finish putting everything back together, guys, so I can give you the overall finished look. So all you gotta do is everything in reverse, which I'm about to do right now. Cut my car or truck off. But yeah, man, I like it. It looks so much better uh, with the big screen. Everything is digital. So let me put everything back and I'll be right back, okay? 100% it. Start up one more time to make sure everything is working. Steering wheel back to how I normally have it. Yes, I am in love with this cluster, man. Just look at it. And then, of course, you got the Lynx Well screen right here to go with the new 2019 Larry Platinum King Ranch, whatever, digital dash. Yes, sir. I love it. I love it. So, huge shout out to Dave again, AKA Dave. Guys, if y'all want one of these dashes, you have an XL, TXL, whatever, STX. If you want a digital dash, not that much money, give a huge shout out, I mean, give uh, uh, Dave uh, a call or well, email. I'm gonna put the email, I'm not gonna put his number on there. Email, and I'll have that in the link in the description, guys. This is a must have mod if you have a XLT, uh, STX, or XL um, truck, man. This is just, it's crazy how, uh, this stuff is, reminds me of how uh how chargers are like all this stuff is kind of plug and play you just got to program it and all that and all that stuff so other than that man this is a quick video huge shout out to david aka dave again uh on uh this cluster man like i'm really 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 happy about this uh and this is a must-have do um so that's why i tell people you don't have to have a lariat or whatever you can kind of put some of the stuff that's in the Larry in here for the zero pro I mean for a, a little bit of price um, but other than that man this is Robert you two on the budget guys so tell me what y'all think comment below on the digital dash man I think it looks awesome um, yeah it looks crazy it looks really good and you can do so look right here that's what I'm going to tell y'all so I can do transmission temp or I can do turbo boost but turbo boost is going to be actually the supercharged boost on mine. See, as you can see, right there. So that is custom. Now, I don't know if none, anybody else who has a supercharger in that 5.0 has that, but I know that is custom and it don't come normally like that. It only comes on the, um, the EcoBoost super twin turbo and all that stuff. But other than that, guys, I don't care. I, I'm just so excited. I can go rambling on and on. This is Robert. You turn a budget. Peace.